Hi Tubes, Detroit Redneck here. I've got a problem. Uh, I got positive, I'm sorry, negative on this one, positive on that one, positive on this one, negative on that one. This battery here, the interstate, is probably 12 years old. And it, it was not stored properly. It was in the back of my Chevy pickup truck, and I used it in the camper a bunch of times. But I hook up my battery tester, positive, positive, negative, negative, and I read normal, All right? It's fully charged. I hit my tester switch, it goes down a little bit, all right? And I got plenty of heat coming off of that for my load, and it's looking good. All right, it goes right back up. Now, the other battery, I put my negative to the negative, positive to the positive, and now I'm reading minus on this one. A week ago, I put this battery on the battery charger. It was dead, and I tested it two days ago, and it was fully charged. And I tested this morning, and now it's reverse polarity. We're still on zero. Hit my tester. It jumps. All right. All right. Now I switch the cables. Positive to positive. I say positive to negative. Negative to positive. We're right up there. Hit the tester switch. Load switch. It comes down, it moves, it's weak. Let go of it, it goes back up. What would cause the battery to do a reverse polarity? You know, and I put this one positive on a negative. All right, now this one, we're, let's say where that one was at. I flip the switch. It don't move at all. So I'm wondering what's up with that. Let me get these untangled. Positive, positive. Negative, negative. We're right back up there. Hit my load test. I'm back up there back up to the goofy battery we're back minus hit the switch we don't move anymore switch them around we're back up to green load test in a week what causes that can somebody answer me a question? What causes a battery to reverse polarity? All right, Tibbs. Trust in God. Keep your powder dry. Thank you for bringing back my 45. God bye. Goodbye. God bless.